In this video, we're going to be talking about two-factor and SMS verification and why you might see them inside and outside of the space, what they're there for, and how they can protect you. So let's jump in and find out what we can do. Fat kiddle, fat, fat kiddle. Coach K here. Today we're going to learn about 2FA SMS authentication, which is basically a second layer of security, so a second password. Okay, so what you need to do first is go on to the Play Store or the iOS Store or on your Chrome browser and get Google Authenticator, okay? You get on your phone, um, I'll show you what that looks like in a minute, or if you get on your computer, this is what it will look like. It's just right a tab at the top and it will click it and come down and will show you all of your authenticator codes for whatever, if it's for Google, for example, or it could be for an exchange like Binance, okay? Now, how it works is basically you put in your normal password and then it asks you to give a second authentication. So usually through your phone, it could be a digital certificate that you have on your phone. It could be a fingerprint scan through your phone, for example, a biometric scan of your face, but generally the 99% of them right now use as SMS or a Google Authenticator, a security token, which basically changes every 30 seconds, which is awesome because uh, it's really hard to get a password that changes all the time. And that's the whole point of it. It's not easy to hack at all. Okay, so um, this is what it will look like. You'll go, you'll log in. This code will constantly be changing every 30 seconds. As you can see, it's at 26 seconds till it changes. You'll put the code that shows here into the exchange account and it will let you in the exchange. You put the wrong account, it'll say you have the wrong, you have the wrong number. Uh, please put it in again. You, the number will change after 30 seconds. You'll put the new number in and it should work. So uh, when you sign up to an account and you want to do 2FA, it will pop up a screen similar to this one. Now, if you're using your phone, you just take your phone and scan the barcode, okay? If you're using Authenticator app, you just highlight it, you click and highlight the box around it, and it will obviously open up an Authenticator and on your phone automatically, the second it sees it, it automatically puts all your information, it'll put your, where, whatever exchange it is, it'll put uh, your email for whichever account it is, et cetera, okay? Then you take that six digit code that pops up and you throw it in the box right beside me and press next step. This is a very important step, so make sure that you pay attention and do what I tell you to do here, okay? Here is a security recovery code. What means is if you lost your phone, which people do, or your computer crashed, or something along those lines, you would need to actually be able to get your uh, 2FA again, and you won't be able to get in your exchange. And you can still do it without saving this code, but it makes it takes a long time. And if, let's say, you were trading, and you had a trade you wanted to sell, well, now you can't get an exchange account. That's a big problem for you, right? Because if it drops a lot, you could lose money. So the whole point is make sure you back this up. It's not very hard. Copy that, put it on a USB somewhere safe, uh, or just write it down somewhere in a notepad that's safely uh, stored somewhere. And yeah, that's basically what you do to keep that recovery code. Um, and it could be even as simple as putting them on uh, a cloud-based software. But remember, if your cloud gets hacked, they could have access to that key. And if they know your password and username, they could log in as you. So just be very careful and cautious that you don't put them in a high-risk security place. Right, the next thing is SMS. So basically it's very simple to set up. You click that you wanna set it up. This is how, how they do on Binance. You put your phone number in, you click send SMS, it sends you a number. You put the number in, you click submit, and then you've set up your SMS certification. Then every time you wanna log into Binance, it will pop up this screen. You did SMS, you'll click send SMS again. A phone uh, number will pop up on your phone that's lasts for 30 seconds. You then type in that number uh, into the SMS and click submit and boom, you get in the account. So that's how it works. Hope that was a pretty good explanation for you guys. See you guys very shortly on the next one. Fat kiddo, fat, fat kiddo, fat kiddo, huge fat.